We must, as a continent, embrace democracy and create and nature those institutions that protect and promote the freedoms of ordinary citizens. The challenge for us, the new crop of African leaders, is to shun repression and misgovernance and to create a new society with new values. We are a new generation which must focus on building strong economies, creating jobs, and developing a qualitative and affordable social delivery system, especially in the fields of health and education. We must embrace ICTs and become part of the global village. The ICTs will enable us to realize our full potential and bring all citizens to the same level of development. This is our vision. As a country, to bring stability, security, unity, and peace and development to the people of Zimbabwe, and indeed to the wider Africa. I won the last election, but there was no transfer of power because President Mugabe had the guns, while I had the people's mandate. We cannot allow guns and bullets to be superior to the people's sovereign will. And as a country and as a people, we drive our hope from the experiences of our African brothers in Senegal, Zambia, and Malawi that it is possible to turn over a new leaf through a peaceful transition despite the tortures and painful history. 